My name is Brent Jay, and I'm the Vice President of AWS Support. I started in AWS Support in 2011, and it was a very different place. There were only 20 of us. The change has been fantastic. It's been exciting to see us now in 88 cities around the world, on six continents and 32 countries. I am able to see people all over the world that are helping customers in 190 countries. Enterprise support is something we've built uh, by working with customers for the last eight years and listening to their needs. It really consists of people, it consists of technology, and it consists of program. When customers come to AWS, they're going to get a range of benefits from lower cost, access to more technology, better innovation. They want to move fast. And, and by having enterprise support, we're always available to help them. We're being responsive so that they can continue to take advantage of all of the benefits of AWS. My name is Chris. I'm a technical account manager for AWS support. We not only engage in these break fix uh, and escalations for customers, we really try to focus on make that relationship, build a relationship, and be proactive about what we're accomplishing for customers. So oftentimes, we'll, we'll see things, we'll, we try to anticipate their needs on behalf of them. The first uh, uh, contact is our technical account manager, and this guy uh, really makes things easy for us. It's very rewarding in the sense that Customers um, uh, truly do value us from that perspective. And we're not just trying to, say, push services. We're there to really focus on their outcomes and uh, enable customers based on their business needs. You cannot do what we do. You cannot grow the way that we grow. You cannot um, build the things that we build if you don't have fantastic, proactive, constructive support. We're really fortunate every year to have a lot of customers share their stories on top of us. What I'm most proud of with AWS support is how many customers we've helped and how interesting their stories are. As a result of last year, because of using a trusted advisor and also enterprise support uh, team's feedback, we were able to save $2.5 million. Well, we've had a me very measurable cost savings. We've had, we think, 50% over two years, effectively driven by AWS bringing our own cost down. Beyond that, they really get help in being more secure, more available. Uh, we really help them integrate new features. 80% of our work is actually best practice guidance. I think AWS Enterprise Support is different because we are customer obsessed. We are um, focused on way more than break fix and not simply fixing the traditional problems uh, that happen in an infrastructure environment.